give us understanding unto the same thing. Only the word of God can change your world. As you listen to this broadcast by Christian Information Network Ministry, your world shall change. God wants it, ignorance. My people are perishing because of what? Lack of knowledge. So that's the first thing I have five points which I'm not going to go into now. I'm just, you know, clearing the ground. Praise God. For you to understand that if you have the strategic, that is strategic prayer for if that bring effective result, but it starts from you. What I'm dealing with this morning is you yourself to understand where you stand. In redemption, where you stand in the word of God, understanding the importance of the knowledge of the word of God, having the knowledge of God, having the understanding of the face of God, having the understanding of the spiritual things, to understand where you stand that you are not sitting in the Yogodo, you are not sitting in the Bible, you are seated somewhere. Where is that place? The Bible says you are meant to sit where in heavenly places. Far above the demons called principalities and powers, that is where you are seated. You are meant to sit with Jesus Christ. So when you are walking, you are walking in heaven alongside with Jesus. When you sit down, you are sitting with Jesus. When you are in the classroom, you are with Jesus. When you, where you are in your place of work, you have the understanding. I am not an ordinary person. I am a translator person. When somebody dies, they is translated. He cannot meet with people in the world again. I mean, yes, it's now a spirit being. But let me tell you, the day you are born again, you have already become a spirit being. Jesus was talking in John chapter 3 to Nicodemus. Very glory I said to you. I said to man before again, cannot see the kingdom of heaven. And the two of us were confused and said, How can this thing be? How can somebody be born after he has been born from his mother's will he enter the second time? And Jesus Christ looked at him and said, You are a leader in Israel. You don't understand this thing. You are a Pharisee. You don't understand this thing. He that is born of the flesh is flesh. He that is born of the spirit is what? You are what? If you are born again, the Bible says you are now what? Why are you now behaving like ordinary human? Why are you afraid of what make other people to afraid? Why are you really clean? You are trying to redo the work of redemption in your life. Why do you allow poverty to sit with you? Why do you become a shameful person in the society? And they say it's coming in, coming in, close your door, close your door. Tell him that I am not around. Because the one you borrow before you have not paid, say it's coming again. No credit today, come to my. Have you ever seen that uh, level? Praise <laughs> God. It's always there. No credit today, come to my. No credit today, come to my. They are talking to some people. Shout hallelujah. I say shout hallelujah. I tell you, without no credit today, come to my. There are some people that are credit worthy. Is that not so? That when they get there, if they want to buy 5,000, say, ah, ah, daddy, ah, mommy. And it's your rule, I'll go with this, 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 i will go and they have not paid us. And you see, my old man traveled. When it comes, I have called him. Who has you for those things? It is because you know you are not ready to what he shouts hallelujah. I say shout hallelujah. You know, once it's better for some people to come and collect glory. Yes, sir. Yeah, Amen. I mean, yes. so that collect glory. The one they collect before they have not finished paying that, they say you should come again. Because they know that company is running away. They say come and collect glory again. Other banks will get her they said, ah, uh, and you can put it, or whatever their names are. Why is it that it is only them that are brought out tonight? If the end of it has gone to meet such a person, those of you that know, 
two of us. They said, why is it that you are not patronizing our bank? And sir, anything, it is not just ordinary marketer that go to some company to meet the owner and say, we want you to come and do business with us. Because they know it's credit worthy. I want you all to understand that in Christ Jesus, you are a spirit being. That is what you are missing if you are not born again. You are a what? A spirit being. And that is why when you are now praying, you can transmit in the spirit realm. <laughs> Say amen. amen. Is somebody got here this morning? Yes, you can transmit in the spirit realm. Mention one point and wraps up some things. For you to pray strategically and get an effective result, you must visualize or dream out your expected miracle. I repeat, you must what? Visualize or have a dream of your expected miracles. I will talk about that one ago and then I will understand. What you don't see, you don't get. At times we ask you out for some things and you don't even understand what you're asking. Praise the Lord. That's something God is making me to get to understand. Let me give you an example. Somebody is sitting and he said he has a bladder problem and he said his bladder is weak. Are you listening to me? And you are not praying, God, heal my bladder. God, heal my bladder. And you have never seen bladder in your life. You don't even know what that bladder looks like. You don't even understand what you are asking for. Somebody hear me? Yes, sir. Knowledge is important. We go to hospital at times, not because we know that doctor is the one that will deliver us, but to even know what we not what is wrong with us. Because there are things that are wrong with you when the doctor and I will tell you and say this is what is wrong. It is possible, and of course, the, the, the psychologists are there also to cancel it. It may be stress. I was with one person uh, on my street, wanted to sing and things like that. We used to be we used to be a chairman also on the street before. And, and we are now talking, they see, and now asking that uh, they want to see me when I travel, they are going to do for me, and then when I went there, I said, oh, I'm coming, I'm coming. And uh, you know, Saturday morning, and I'm going to pray with him. Then we are now talking. Now, he was trying to look at everything from spiritual. That is, maybe it's a spiritual attack. Maybe somebody is trying to attack. Praise God. I allow you, you know, I have a cancer, I allow you to see you who might first. I sat down, I allow you to start and download. When you think I said, nobody's attacking you. He's a Christian. He's a minister too. He said, the Bible says, the cost upon the cost that she shall not stand. Look at me. I said, nobody's attacking you. You cannot attack me. When you attack, you attack Jesus. Praise God. Hallelujah. It is a hard thing for anybody to think against the proof. So you are, you see, is it what you see? What when you wake up? There are things that happen in the night when you have slept. If it is not God that is watching over you, no wonder that the that will keep it stretch and never sleep in the and that's not the thing you thank God for. You know, many of you, because you thank God for something yesterday, you think that you can't do well or not. You will have to do well. You will learn when. Praise God. Your thanks should even be more than your request. Because when you thank, I can like say, God, thank you. Ah, Lord Jesus, I'm able to see. I can carry my leg today. I, oh, Jesus, thank you. You have done it again. You have done it again. Without any other prayer, 
I, along that line, is the prayer of that day, tomorrow is already guaranteed. That I will see tomorrow. Ah, I see today. Thank you, Jesus. Death is giving left and right. Kidnapping and there. My life is preserved. I'm not kidnapped. My wife is not kidnapped. My body is not kidnapped. Lord Jesus, it is not security from government, though. it is security of heaven. Thank you for the angels that are on guard. Angels that are watching over us. Thank you for the covering of the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the fire that surrounds me, that surrounds my family. That's around even my church members. I pray for you. If I don't pray for you, what will you do? My hair will have turned white or gray. If I don't pray for you, if I have a hand, run in and there. Shout out to A pastor in a correct. His member was kidnapped. Praise the Lord. He was kidnapped. This matter of last month just leave. Kidnapped on his farm, a young man. A young man kidnapped on his farm. They collected the level million. Himself and other people that were kidnapped. I think there is a um, maybe the like the in-law was there, this and that, and some other people and other. So when they were kidnapped, you know they are strategic. They must have been watching. Him. They know that he has a, 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 a brother. That is even helping to do the farm, you know, in abroad. You are asking for maybe 50 million and you reduce until it got to 11 million, 10 million. You say, no, they will kill it, they will kill all of them. They release some people to take the rest of them or fight for them. And they have to pay 10 million until 10 million. No, they have to they have to do another one million. Now they somebody have to teach them the strategy. Don't give all the money. Tell them that you have tried and you have been able to see another 50 and it's okay, bring it. When they brought it, when they brought it, they said, they now now made it. They put an in to it just to tell them that no, there is no way to go again. And they said, okay, you can go with the 20. They collect the level million and 50 pounds. Shall I do? That's what we need to pray for ourselves. Pray for ourselves. So that you are not, they say, ah, they are kidnapping, kidnapping. Who knows how to work in Nigeria? If it is not he that keeps us that does not stand us, give him thanks. Hallelujah. I told the, 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 the person I'm coming, I said, look, oh, I said, you know that we talk sometimes. Your hand is not paying you, which. You are suspecting that the hand is not going to function very well. I said, look, I told you, everything about your children, I'm cancelling those of you that are our home is here. Your children, they are married, they are gone, let them live their life. You are not their desire. Jesus is their desire. But he has not given back to child. You see, he's having problem. He has graduated so many years. He has not even got a job. And that is the stress that is killing you. It is ignorance. Because after you die, you will only cause problems because there is no money to bury you. I don't know what is attacking you. I don't want to attack yourself. Say, forget about this, forget about that. Sleep! Rest your brain! If the medical people are going to attend to you, the physician let them attend. Say, even if you don't raise your brain, they attend to you, it will not work. So there are some things that when you have the knowledge, you know what to do yourself, baby, and that will just go. But there are some of you, you are a medical doctor by yourself. When something you say, ah, oh, it seems I want to have any paradox, paracetamol. Ah, I know how this thing is like my grave. Who told you? You go and get an identity and you swap it. You swallow so many that can even kill you. Is there any drug that does not have that pass effect? There is no drug. Shout out to me. That one's out to stop. Praise God. What am I saying this morning? God. If you visualize what you want, many of us 
us, we, 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 we sway here and there. He doubts out of Matthew, uh, Luke chapter 11, verse 6 to 13. Somebody went to his friend in the night. Do you remember that story? He said, my friend, go, 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 in the middle of the night. Who is that? It is me. I have a visitor. There is nothing to feed the visitor with. Please give me a, a loaf of bread. Is that awesome? And the one said, don't trouble me, daddy. Frank, don't trouble me. I'm already sleeping. This time, I'm not going to come out again. Don't trouble me. And we, what, what did that friend? The friend now said, okay, oh, good night. Oh. He didn't do that. The Bible says, He said, I'm going to sleep, so I sleep for me. And he said, You want me to put me to shame? I asked somebody I need to give food to. He said, Yeah, you have it. He said, But he now woke up and said, How many do you need? He said, One. Take five so that you will not come back again. I'm giving you because I don't want you to come and just talk to you. Have you? So have extra so that. So that you are not going to come to disturb me. Take more. The friend who was asking for bread was strategic. Is that right? He was not asking for plenty of things. There are times, you see, your prayers, topics are too many. They are what? Go to Foka. Hey, go. This and that. Hey, give me this and that. Hey, you remember this one. Don't give me that. that. Hey. All those prayers, leave there as something you're asking for, you don't need to ask for it. God watches over you. He gives you your belief. There are some things, they are maintenance thing. Family altar will take care of that. Are you following me now? But you want a breakthrough. Like convention is coming, and God is going to give you the scepter. But you may have a scepter, you don't know what to do with it. Now, when you have that understanding, you must have, like I said last year, begin to get ready of three things. Three things you want to eat hard. And that's how we carry the fasting from second. Amen. We are having fasting from Wednesdays, second to Sunday. Towards the conversion. Are you ready for that? Yes, sir. So, people say, I reckon you have told us this last week, so I'm going to pray for you. Amen. It is what the reason we do. We are fasting. Because this is the year of what? Multiple what? Yes. You must have it in full. Amen. But if you are not strategic in the way of prayer, my prayer is that this year will be more glorious than last year. Yes. You will achieve your goals. You will have breakthroughs in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, the friend was focused. Have some things focused. There are some things that cannot, that will take care of itself. I mean, but there are some things that have to do with your life, your destiny. You want to move forward in this particular area. You need to concentrate. Hallelujah. You remember also in that same look, look at some lot of example that Jesus gave concerning prayer. That's Luke 18 verse 3. Luke 18 verse 3. The Bible says that there was a widow. Alright? Who went to a judge and told the judge, please avenge me of my enemies. It was not in the court of the judge. He went to the house of the judge. Maybe he asked someone to take lawyer, praise God, or whatever they are doing there. He went to the judge, avenge me of my enemies. And the judge said, who is that? Who is that? Send I will send I will. The second one is coming. Judge. I can't begin you. I'll bend you of my enemies. Who is that? Send I will. This one, not trouble me. At the point, the judge said, Come. Though I don't fear God. And I don't have respect for man. You don't know that judges are very proud of you. That's how many of them are called you. They are very proud. You don't know how. Somebody that when he sleeps, Amen. 
No matter how popular you are, even if you say you should be reminded, when you take it from that thought that we are not taking you to get you reminded in the prison hospital. You may know presidents. Eh? President will not interfere. The only thing that you can do is that you will go to Nigeria. Then they can go to another higher court of it for an expatriate motion on so so and so and so and so thing, I mean, but you will see the one that he said is still the law. Even a customer court, customer is then put in the air, go, 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 go. You want to buy some of the money? Oh, yeah, you go, tie, tie, you go, you finish it, you go, 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 Oh, you want to go to check it? Oh, wait, I'm not going to come in here. No, I mean, but, sorry, you know, the wife is on the door. Oh, why did those magistrates go to court to them? Praise God. That is a joke. The man said, do I do fear that you are going to say? Oh, because this woman is coming every day. That are hitting the same point. This only this matter. So that he will not just weep, she will not weary me. Before they got to court, he gave her the judgment she was asking. And God says, Look at the unjust judge. Jesus was not of it. And he hear the unjust judge. Will God not help right rights for the deliverance of his people who are falling into him? But well, yesterday you asked for bread. Today, rice. Tomorrow, yam. Say, God, I didn't want bread today. It is yam now that I want to eat. Because that yam, maybe heaven is cooking, is preparing the yam. What did you take my day? In fact, I don't want yam again. God, spaghetti. There is no prayer that you pray strategically with something that you don't mention with fathers, even than the results. How many of you have played this one? Devil yes. has no right to oppress you. Yes. You are to confront the devil. Yes. You have the Lord. So the lawyer will say, according to section so, so and so and so and so, to defeat the opponent against. When you say the Bible says, this is the will of God concerning my life. I tell